I'm married to a builder, a high-end builder in the Mount Washington Valley, and we've built many homes in the valley. And one day we received a call with an offer to buy a mountain. And they said, you should buy this mountain because you're probably the only person that will be able to build on this mountain because my husband's reputation. He can um, do wonderful things with hard pieces of property. So we looked into it and six weeks later, we owned a mountain. My husband and I are very fortunate to be living in this home. It has everything in it that we wanted. We have the beauty, we have the grounds, we have the open living concept, we have the windows. We feel like you're really outside. You wake up every morning and all you see are mountains. You go into the dining room, living room, kitchen, you, you see the mountains, the fresh air. You open the door, you get the fresh air. One of my favorite parts of our home is the pool that we put in. And it's just fun to go down there. We have a big gas grill down there and to cook out and eat. We have a lot of lobster bakes down there. Um, it keeps the mess out of the main house. We have a, a small little kitchenette beside the pool. And just to go down there and relax, especially on the weekends, shut the door to the house, go down there for the day, invite your friends, and we have a wonderful time down there. Uh, we wanted a comfortable home. We wanted it cozy. Even though we have 6,500 square feet of living space, it's very communal. We can all gather together. Uh, we also have our private spots, but um, it's open and very comfortable, very comfortable. And it's not empty. It's just full of happiness. My home is, I want to say, very maintenance free. It's very easy to keep up with. Everything is available. Um, I think it has, being a builder's wife, it has more than a normal home would have. It has everything. Um, we have the central vac with the little dusters. We, every, after building homes, 125 homes, it has exactly what we want and what everybody wants. It's the open space, the living, um, the bedrooms are situated where your children have their privacy, very open place to have entertainment, dinners, and cookouts. When I wake up in the morning, my views are over are the mountains. And then I walk into my great room. I mean, they're, they're, it's just like you're outside all the time. Sitting in the grand room with all the large windows, you can look out and you can watch how the valley changes with the weather. Um, one half hour, it could be raining out there, and you'll have a beautiful rainbow, and then you'll have, maybe the clouds will roll in. Um, it's an ever-changing view, um, but it's spectacular because there's really nothing there but the sky and the trees and the mountains. And then at night, um, actually on, a, on the moon nights, the nights that are with the moon, you can see the moon shining down on the mountains which is beautiful. So whenever you look out those windows, there's something always happening and something always changing. And it's, it's just fun to watch. Um, the views just don't stop. They do not stop. Then in the winter, um, when their Mount Cranmore is open, the ski mountain, um, they light up the side of the mountain with lights. Um, it's, it's kind of neat to look out there and see the lights. I don't use shades or blinds because it's too beautiful out there. So I wake up in the morning to the mountains and I say good night to the mountains. It's, 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 I'm very fortunate. I have a beautiful kitchen, a gourmet kitchen. Um, I have beautiful appliances. I have Sub-Zero and Wolf. I have granite countertops, Typhoon Bordeaux that is made in Brazil, and my I have custom cabinetry of red birch. One of the advantages of my kitchen is that it's open, and I am as I am cooking or preparing meals and for entertainment, I still have view of everybody in my dining room, my four season room, my grand room, and my family room. So it's we're all together, and we can talk 
and enjoy each other, watch a football game, have a glass of wine together while I'm in the kitchen. From our master bedroom, we walk into our, the master bath, and from the master bath, we have a nice uh, walk-in closet with built-ins. One of the highlights in my master bath is the rainforest marble that I have for countertops and also the insert in my flooring with surrounded by marble, along with a, a walk-in marble shower. I have beautiful sunrises in the morning, um, red, orange sunrises. And then um, every morning, starting in the spring, my birds come back and they sing to me every morning at 4, 4.30. And they'll sing for about one and a half to two hours and then go to sleep. Um, I look forward to, to spring because of the birds coming back and everything turning green. It's a wonderful time of year up here. Winters up here, especially coming in for the day and lighting our fire, a beautiful crackling fire, um, just to sit in the grand room or the family room and just watch the fire is a very relaxing before bedtime. Even the storms are fantastic up here with all the beautiful windows that we have, the bolts of lightning, it's just fantastic. Something that you don't see every day. Um, and then after a storm, we have the beautiful double rainbows that goes right across my whole property. A double rainbows, um, beautiful sights from those um, gorgeous big windows that we have. Lots to see up here. The Mount Washington Valley area is famous for its foliage. And I always look forward to that at the end of summer. It's something to, that we wait for. And I guess fiery reds and oranges are in the, in the woods. The, the green turns to fiery red and orange and yellow. We start out with the bright red and then we go to the orange and yellow. But it's a, um, it's a fantastic um, sight to see how, how they change from green to the autumn colors. We are not isolated here in Glen because uh, we have an airport less than a half an hour away. We have a two and a half hour ride or less to Boston. And we are off Route 16, which eventually goes south on matching up with Route 95. I also want to mention that living on Pear Mountain, that we are very private here, very quiet, um, enjoy the privacy, but we are not isolated. We are close to the shopping malls, the restaurants, the hiking trails, the ski mountains. We have four ski mountains that are very close to us um, and the rivers. It's a great place, centrally located. And even though you feel like you're out in the woods, you're really not. I hope that whomever buys our home has the same feeling that we have.